Hear the flowers kind of crying loud. The breeze is sounding sad. Oh no, tell me when did we become so cold and empty inside? Lost away a long time ago. Did we really turn that blind? We don't see that we keep hurting each other. No, all we do is just fight. Now we share the same bright sun, the same round moon. Why don't we share the same love? Tell me why not? Life is shorter than most that thought. A few weeks ago on the Juma journey, we met up with star Proteus cricketer Vernon Philander. A few weeks later, we meet up with him again today, engaged in a blanket drive, currently at Canal Walk Shopping Centre in Cape Town. Vernon, a few weeks later, uh, once again, it's an honour to have you back on the show with us. Thanks. Yeah, it's an absolute pleasure to be back on the show. Um, and as I said the last time, you know, it's, you know, it's always close to my heart to always give back to you know, the communities. And, uh, you know, obviously, you know, you know, with this past few days that we had, you know, obviously, you know, with a few storms as well. And, uh, you know, you know yeah, I just felt it good, you know, obviously to give back, you know, to those obviously less fortunate and those obviously hit by the storms. So, so yeah, you know, you know, you know yeah, that's the reason why we're having this blanket drive, you know, mm. to collect a few blankets, you know, in order to obviously hand out and, 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 and make sure that, you know, obviously a few, you know, obviously less fortunate people is more comfortable. Mm. A few weeks ago when we met up with you, you were in Mitchell's Plane, uh, meeting the communities there, uh, signing autographs, taking photos. You are at Canal Walk today, engaged in the blanket drive. What are the marks of a true champion? Remaining humble, because it's something that impresses me all the time. The second time we meet, and I pick that up immediately. Are those the true hallmarks of a champion? <laughs> yeah, I think, you know, for me, you know, it's, it's pretty simple. You know, I always try and keep my feet on the ground and, and always trying to engage with people, you know. Um, you know, it's not often that people get the opportunity, you know, obviously, you know, to speak to people like us, you know, in person. And that's what I, you know, always take time out to obviously come and engage with people, you know, on a personal level. So, so yeah, I think, you know, I always try and stay humble. I obviously, try, always, you know, always try and give back to the communities. And, uh, yeah, I think, you know, just to obviously, you know, to, you know yeah, just keep your feet on the ground and, 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 and interact with people, you know, mm. you know, as if they're normal people as well. Mm. It's definitely something that as uh, Kung Fu martial artists we can learn from and even citizens in general to remain grounded. But now take us through this blanket drive. Um, I, we understand that the entire month of June will be devoted to this blanket drive. Just speak us through that. Yeah, I think, you know, you know, the blanket drive you know, will run for the month of June, you know, to, until the end of June. So people can come down and just, you know, obviously drop their blankets to nations, you know, in this little box here in front of Pick and Pay. So... And, uh, yeah, I mean, you know, yeah, we'll go out and, and, and distribute them, you know, and obviously in the next week or so, and, you know, obviously make sure that, you know, some people get comfortable out there. Mm. It's a tough time in Cape Town. You made reference to the storm, so it's an excellent drive and an excellent campaign, and we want everyone in Cape Town to become involved in it. Just a bit further afield, uh, you scheduled to open the Vernon Philander Cricket Academy in Paul. Tell us about that. Yeah, it's busy times, eh? Um, you know, yeah, you know, about a month back, you know, I found the time out and, uh, you know, I had a little chat to Salik Nakadin, you know, which is the, obviously, you know, the, the assistant coach at, you know, obviously, you know, the Western Province or, or Cape Cobras. And, uh, you know, yeah, we sat down and we said, you know, you know, we, you know, yeah, we might as well take cricket out into the pole area. You know, mm. I think, you know, that's the area, you know, where cricket has been a little bit neglected. Mm. And, uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, hopefully, you know, you know, yeah, this academy will obviously, you know, see a few... Uh, you know, a few future Springboks, you know, so, or Proteas. So, so, yeah, I mean, you know, that's the main aim behind it. You know, and hopefully we can get a few Proteas coming through there. Absolutely. We look forward to that. Uh, it's a very busy time for you. Uh, you'll be leaving South Africa also very soon. We're not going to talk about that. But we are still in the month of June. Youth Day, the entire month is actually devoted to youth. In fact, a bit earlier on, we chatted to youth out in Lotus River and they engage in a campaign to look after the environment. Now, as a cricket ambassador for South Africa and as an international cricket star, what message of hope do you have for our youth in South Africa? Yeah, I think, you know, if, you know, yeah, if we look at our youth, our youth is ultimately, you know, the leaders of tomorrow. And, and I think, you know, if there's a one message that I can send out to them, you know, it's... It, it's to keep leading, you know, and, 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 and pave the way for the guys to follow. So, so I think, you know, you, you know, for our youth out there, guys, you know, go out there, be yourselves, um, you know, make yourselves proud, you know, empower yourselves, you know, to be the best, you know, that you can be in what, you know, whichever field you might obviously may find yourself in. And yeah, I mean, you know, you know, just, keep, you know just keep leading the way. Mm. But then, once again, second time in a month, it's been a pleasure, in fact, a privilege to meet up with you again. All the best with the rest of the year and all the best with the blanket drive. Important, we want the communities in Cape Town to come out and support it. 
Yeah, thanks a lot, man. You know, yeah, you guys are always welcome. So, so yeah, you know, hopefully we can collect a few more blankets today and, and obviously make it work. Mm. Support the worthy cause. That is the Vernon Philander Jive blanket drive the entire month of June right here at Canal Walk outside Pick and Pay. I'm about to lose the battle and cross the line. I'm about to make another mistake. And even though I try to stay away, everything around me keeps dragging me in. I can't help thinking to myself, what if my time would end today? Chance before.